All righty. Hello, Medea tribe. Uh, we are back yet again for another tribal council. It feels like clockwork at this point. I will ask each of the four of you a question before we get into the vote tonight. Um, first tonight, I am heading over to Jackson. Uh, Jackson, this is now your tribe's fifth time losing, your fifth time voting someone out. And this is turning out to be one of the biggest decimations of a tribe I've ever seen in an org ever. Um, are you all starting to lose hope or how does the morale on the tribe feel overall at this point? Um, you know, it, it's as much as we love seeing your beautiful face, Meg, it's, it's not fun to be here all the time. Um, but despite that, I do think morale is okay. I think that we are all pretty upbeat people and, and optimistic people. And I think that we continue to see opportunities for improvement and um, and we kind of approach every challenge as if we're, we're gonna win it. I don't, I wouldn't say that we're super down on ourselves and I know our, our track record should indicate that we should be, um, but we're, we are painfully optimistic. So there is still the hope there, yes? Yeah, keep the hope. Okay, all righty. Uh, next up is Stoner tonight. Stoner, are you here? <laughs> oh, sorry, I was changing. Oh, you're okay, Stoner, hello. Um, Stoner, my question to hello, you. Hello, Meg. Thank you. Uh, with this vote, Stoner, are we still thinking in terms of how to keep the tribe strong or have we shifted into thinking about who we can trust in the merge? Um, I think like for me personally, it's keeping the tribe strong. Like I'm, we've been here five times in a row and I think we're all strong players, but I'm not trying to be here a six time in a row. Um, I think we're still at least round off from merge. So that's my personal thought. And Did he freeze for anyone else or is it just me? Yeah. He disappeared. Oh, can you see me? You back, he... Sonar? Yes, yeah, sorry, I heard you. I, the last thing I heard was you think there's one more round until merge. Yeah, I think there's another round to merge, and that's, you know, winning challenges on people's minds right now. Does anyone else have either the same or a differing opinion on when merge might come, what they think is coming next? Also, hi, Jackson's friends. No, no other comments on merge? Okay. <laughs> Next, uh, I have a question for CJ. Uh, CJ, so all of you guys have a 25% chance of going home tonight. So with such bad odds, does that make you want to take the easy route for the vote? Or does that make you want to think about taking a bigger risk? And then what are the pros and cons to both? Um, well, that's a good question. Um, obviously, you know, I came over from a different tribe and Obviously, we were only had two of us, and one of them's gone. Um, so it's just kind of me here. Um, but I mean, <clears throat> at this point, you just have to hope that you know you are able to form enough connections. And um, as far as like taking a big risk or anything like that. Um, I really wouldn't say that. Um, I think that like Jackson spoke earlier, um, I mean, yeah, we've been coming back here, but we haven't lost hope that, you know, we can win a challenge and all four of us are good competitors. Um, it just, for some reason, each challenge, it, it's just not piecing together for some reason. Um, but it doesn't mean that, you know, that they've just, the other tribes have just put up some crazy times, like, especially on that puzzle. I mean, I've, I've, I'm really good at puzzles. So seeing a two minutes is, that's mind boggling to me, especially a rotating jigsaw. Um, but no, I mean, I don't, I don't really see it as, you know, taking a big shot. I think it's just like, like uh Starner was talking about earlier i mean at this point you know with only four of us left you just kind of have to you know um go with what you think um is gonna make 
the tribe strong going into the next challenge and so that we can officially break this curse that you um so happened to mention in our chat that we had <laughs> already thank you cj um and then last again but certainly not least is kendall kendall i swear that this is just down to no the i know you're totally fine i'm not um, of the tribal questions it just happens to be that randomized that way but kendall <laughs> With everyone just trying to stay alive tonight, um, do you think that there's like one or two plans going around or do you think there's a lot of different plans going around and how do you navigate that? There's probably one set plan and you just hope that you've been told the right one set plan. Do you feel like you can trust the people that you're talking to and working with at this point or do you think it's like every man for himself since the tribe is so small? I hope I can trust people so far I can, but you never know. Survivor changes. All righty. Thank you, Kendall. Uh, those are the questions I have. Jack, do you have any questions for the Medea tribe? Uh, I will ask the same question I asked last time. Raise your hand if you feel like you're in danger tonight. That is a stark difference from last time, going from one person to all but one person. And with that said, I think we should get to the votes. All righty, before we send people over to the voting booth, does anyone have anything else they want to say? Um, if not, I will get started with sending Jack over to the breakout room. All righty. Uh, Jack, if you can head over there and I will send the first person over to submit their vote. All righty, first up I have on my list is Stoner. Um, feel free to give shout outs, talk amongst yourselves as we vote. Hi friends. Hey. Shout out that tomorrow's Thanksgiving I get food. Yes, I'm so excited <laughs> about that. I'm pumped. It's like it's it's like it feels like last Thanksgiving was like ten years ago. Like I've been so ready for it. We can eat whatever we want, and nobody can judge. I'm pumped. Me too. I just like Thanksgiving food mostly. Like it's just good. Yeah. And I only we literally only make that stuff once a year, so I'm like, let's go. Yeah. You guys having a big dinner or what? Just my family. I live with my parents, so my sisters and their kids are coming over. Right. Well, that'd Alrighty, be fun. is back. Uh, next up, we have DJ. <laughs> game time <laughs> mood stoner that is the mood <laughs> Such a I don't know if y'all can tell but I'm also doing my lovely very legal now that I live in Colorado Smoking. Oh, I want to give a shout out to Jabbar and say fuck you, Jay. As per usual, thank you. Oh, and this is a shirt that the lovely our lovely production member Courtney got me this shirt. She she made it for me. She customized it. She's perfect. Shout out to Courtney. Yes, yeah, shout out to Courtney. We love her. All righty, CJ is back. So next up is Jackson. Again, Kendall last, even with the Zoom randomization, it really, it really doesn't like you, Kendall. The, the I think it's really funny and it's fitting. <laughs> and I mean, then Kendall. I mean, how many curses are you going to put on us, Meg? Like, seriously. Oh, the Zoom thing honestly might be alphabetical order. I don't know how it works. Um, the Zoom might show up on my thing as alphabetical order, but <laughs> the random.org, I don't have an answer for that one. <laughs> I'm just kidding. 
I don't believe in curses. I just think that the other the other tribes have just been putting up some crazy times. Like that puzzle, I've never seen anyone do a puzzle in two that puzzle in two minutes. Alrighty, again, last but not least is Kendall. But I figured you guys were gonna make it difficult with the right with the rotation instead of a regular jigsaw. I was definitely hoping for a regular one. Have any of you guys seen the new season of Big Mouth? Because holy shit, it is raunchy. I've seen uh -huh. episode one and I'm already concerned for my sanity. I'm on episode eight. And there is an elf orgy <laughs> happening right now. Oh my god. <laughs> Proceed. Well. Alrighty, that is everyone. I will bring Jack back. Just a second. <laughs> All right, I do have the vote tonight. If anyone has any advantages or idols they would like to play, now would be the time to do so. Um, I do. I would like to play the Medea doesn't come back to travel idol. Uh, unfortunately, that is an idol from the future, meaning I cannot confirm if or if, if not it exists. So I cannot accept it at this time. I apologize, but all was, votes against CJ still do. Count. Joke, so. Does anyone else have anything they'd like to play? Alrighty. Once the votes are read, the decision is final. The person voted out will be asked to leave the Zoom call immediately. I'll read the votes. First vote. CJ. Still going to show up reverse because fuck me. Second vote. Jackson. Third vote. CJ. Two votes CJ, one vote Jackson. Final vote. And the fifth person voted out is yet to be determined. We do have a tie between CJ and Jackson. How this will work is the following. You guys have 10 minutes to decide how you want to vote. Uh, all conversation must be kept within here and out loud. Kendall, do you want to draw a rock or no? If, uh, then Chris and Kendall, both of you will vote. If both of you vote for the same person, that person will be going home. If you do not both vote for the same person, you two will draw rocks. Can't pronounce English language. And one of you will be going home. With that said, I wish you two the best of luck. And I wish CJ and Jackson the best of luck as well. Your 10 minutes begins now. Kendall, do you want to draw a rock or no? <laughs> I don't want to draw a rock. Hell no. I'm keeping I would, Jackson. I think I'm going to vote out Jackson tonight. I think I'm going to go to a rock tonight. Because okay. if Jackson leaves tonight, then me and you would have majority over CJ next round. And I think right now that might be one of the safest bets for us. I know you might not want to do that. And if you don't want to do that, I'm okay with that. If you want to draw a rock, we can draw a rock. But uh, I think Jackson right now has a lot of connections on the other side. Uh, me, Jackson, Stevie, De 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 Brian, and Jess are all at a five-person chat. And we were all against you. Yeah, and I'm not trying to play like that. I don't want to stick to one group all the way through. Um, you know, you think about it, J Jackson, feel free to talk too. I just want to 
I, I want to get my thoughts out in the open and see what you're thinking, Kendall, because I don't want either of us to go home, but I think Jackson needs to go. I'm keeping Jackson. Well, Stoney, you right, want... Going to rock. Let me ask you this, Stoney. Why are you fearful of, of connections that I have? Because I'm, I'm more thinking about next round. I'm worried that you two would vote me out next round. So I'm thinking if I take you out tonight, me and Kendall can take out CJ next round. That's my honest to God thought. And, and I think that that is a well thought out thought. I, I don't know why you would assume that I would vote with Kendall one, because on day one, I was connecting with you, not Kendall. Before I even spoke to Kendall about idols, I was giving you other people's uh, idol board guesses, and and I've I've been working with you from the beginning. And so, would you have voted me or Kendall out next round? I, I would have voted Kendall out next round. And All you right. can well, once the season is up, you can go back and watch the confessionals. I from day one, <clears throat> I really like the, the gameplay of the pairing up day one right in it to the end and the the jt and steven archetype is my absolute favorite even if i have to be steven i i love that I, um, I appreciate that. well kendall i mean you heard it you heard it just now do you still want to keep jackson after that yep i'm keeping jackson all right let's go to rocks it seems we've reached some sort of consensus uh stoner are you ready to vote I'm good to vote. Kendall, you guys, are you ready to vote? I'm I just want to vote. say that you guys have seven minutes and 17 seconds left on your clock. So you do I mean, still Kendall have time. Said, I mean, if, if Kendall wants like. to talk, if Kendall wants to talk, we can talk. I'm, I I think Jackson going and CJ going next round is the best for my game. And I think after hearing Jackson say that he was voting on Kendall next round, I think it's best for Kendall's game too to stick with me and not Jackson. Uh, I don't know. That's my thought. Kendall, you got seven minutes. If you want to talk, we can talk. I don't want to see you get have, rocked out. I don't have nothing against Jackson, though, even though hearing that, it's a no, game. I know. <laughs> yeah, I know, but I'm saying, do you want to risk your game for someone who is going to vote you out if we lost again? That's up to you. I think the smartest thing right now is we work together. We take out Jackson. Next year, we take out CJ. I don't trust CJ. CJ's been telling us that he has an idol with three different powers. I know that's all bullshit. He don't have nothing. He would have played it tonight if he had something. I'm not stupid. Like, I want CJ going, but I, I, I'm, I'm worried about Jackson. And after him, I don't know. I, I'm still confused as to why you're so concerned about me knowing people <clears throat> on the other side, because I mean, the people I know, you know. It's and not then, more about knowing people. It's more about, I was just telling Kendall, like, we had an alliance without her. Sure. I mean, and that's on me too, you know. That's okay. Yeah. And but neither of us created that alliance. We were we were yeah. plopped into it, so that's not on us. But for every for for the four people that I know on the other side that you are also talking about, yeah. CJ has has eight of them. And no, that's not correct. I don't. I, I had maybe one connection on the other side, um, so I don't have eight of them. And you also did. 1000% give me your word that you're about not Kindle this round too. So I did. And, and that is, I think part of the game. Um, right. And, and that's why I didn't play. That's why I, I didn't play anything, but um, you're a bigger threat than me. So because, you, because I beat you in the puzzle by three seconds, no, because you have a, because you have a better chance to win the game than I do. Kendall, did Jackson make a final two with you? No. Did he tell you that he was going to vote me out if we lost again? No. Uh, I, I We've been talking that. about Harry Potter. We do no, talk I about that. Harry Potter. <laughs> I respect that. It is what it is. I mean, I'm, I'm, I'm ready. I just... I'm I'd hate to see you go. I think right now our smartest. So what do you think the path is next round? Like, cause my thing is too, if we are, if we just stick to our old tribe lines, they're going to just come after us. If we show that we're willing to vote one of our own, we're willing to take out Jackson. They're going to be open to working with us. That's another big thing that's in my head. I think 
I know you and Jackson connect. Me and Jackson connect. Jackson was my boy. Like I, I know it. I feel like shit voting Jackson out. But I'm thinking about the game. I'm thinking about what the smartest thing is. And I think this is really the smartest thing for us. I, I don't think it benefits the rock situation. I don't want to see you get rocked out. Obviously, I want to see myself get rocked out. But I think for me, I think it's too late. I don't think Jackson's going to work with me after this. But I, would, I wouldn't count that out. I appreciate that. Hopefully, if uh, Kendall gets rocked out, you can still be open to that. <laughs> <laughs> you all have three and a half minutes left. Donnie's got a point. I'm just thinking long term, Kendall. Like, I, I'm not stupid. I'm not letting CJ get past next round. And I'm saying this right out in the open. If he has an idol, he'll take me out. I'm not worried about CJ, but I don't. I'm worried. I was worried about myself next round with you and Jackson ganging up. Jackson telling me right now that he was going to vote your ass out next. That proves to me that my point, I'm, I, I flipped for no reason. But now it's too late. And now I think, I hope that you see Jackson is willing to take you out next round if we lost. I think this way, we're set. Me and you take out CJ. If CJ has an idol, he might take you or Jax now. I don't know which one goes out next round. The I don't smarter think reasoning has. is the taking out someone from your original. Because I think that's going to open our doors. I really do. I, I think I, if we stick to voting them out, we have eight people coming at us hardcore. And I'm scared of that, Kendall. Yeah. Like, we had a whole five person chat without you. So they don't have your back. Chester, Brian, they don't got your back. We yeah. need to start looking out for ourselves. We need to open our doors to other people. I'm sorry, Jackson. Kendall, seriously, no hard feelings. I, <laughs> I, no I've hard. never had the opportunity to play smart, and I need to play smart. Then play smart. I, I need to play smart. Like I love you, Jackson. I'm sorry, dude. Love you, Jackson. All good. Go vote. I'm ready to vote. It seems if we, uh, it seems as if we've reached some sort of consensus. Stoner, are you ready to vote? I would like to vote for Jackson. Kendall, are you ready to vote? I would like to vote for Jackson. I'm not actually confirming your votes yet, but sure. <laughs> uh, CJ Jackson, are you both ready for them to vote? Yes. Yes. Well, I'm confused, but okay. Sorry. Once again, I am going to have you guys go into the breakout rooms <laughs> where you guys will vote with me again. Um, okay. so Jack, you can head over there and I'll send them over one, one at a time. Um, I think the breakout room is still open. It, it definitely is. Um, okay. Uh, okay, work with me, computer, please. You're going to have to send me over to it. <laughs> Do we need a breakout room if we came to a consensus? I mean, why would they need a breakout room? They just made their vote. If we dead ass. We have to do the official votes. We have to do breakout rooms. Okay. Thank you. I hope we get an official million dollars. Uh, <laughs> uh, we are officially too poor for that. Yes. Uh, did it work now, Jack? Okay, that worked. Um, so anyone have a preference on going first, uh, Stoner or Kendall? No, it doesn't I matter. always go last, so I should go first. Okay, I will send Kendall over there first. <laughs> she said she's tired of being last. I'm tired of being last in these challenges. I agree. <clears throat> All righty, Kendall is back. Um, Stoner, I will send you over.
All righty, Stoner's back. I will bring Jack back and he will read the votes. All righty, I do have the votes. Uh, as this is a revote, the time to play any idols or advantages has already passed. When I read the vote, if there is a consensus, the person whose name has come up will have just a few moments before they need to leave. First vote, Jackson. The second vote, the last vote. And the fifth person voted out of Survivor Sahara is Jackson. Good game, Jackson. Jackson, if you have any final words, go right ahead. Stony, no hard feelings. You are the man. I get it. I'm rooting for you. You better go fucking win this game. Kendall, you are so funny every morning when i wake up and you send your little voice memos it's a great start to my day so thank you for making me laugh cj oh, no. don't know y'all that well but good luck in this game thank you boy meg i loved you it was an honor to be hosted by you dc oh, you, long live dc9 oh thank you i love you too thank you jacks nothing but love bro with that jackson thank you for playing but your time has come the tribe has spoken with that, three of you are left. We will see if the Mediator continues into the next round. We're winning. Or it dies right here. No, we're winning this. Winning. I'm winning. Kendall, we're winning this. Let's get it. I'm winning. I like your confidence. With that, y'all are free to go. Have hey, a good Jack. night.